Hi, my name is Cody Schindel and I'm the owner of Canadian Karting News. Hi, my name is Mark Urban and I'm a motorsport content creator. Hi there, I'm Phil Beans. I'm a Toronto-based photographer and I'm very excited to be part of this new Maradness Motorsport Artist Collection. I entered the Maradness Photo Contest as I thought it was a very unique way to showcase my work further in the motorsport community. And I really think it's a great initiative for other photographers looking to showcase their work further, meet new people, and of course you get the opportunity to wear your work. I think that's, that's, that's pretty awesome. I signed up for the Maradness Photo Contest uh, because I've known Dan for a long time and uh, really take notice of the Maradness brand. Um, I knew I had the right photo for the contest and uh, I thought I had a chance at winning and gaining some great exposure. I decided to enter uh, the Maradness Photo Contest because I've been a big fan of the Maradness brand for a while and it was a great opportunity to get one of my photos on the back of a sweater which I'd seen some of the other ones and they looked really cool and I was like man that'd be an incredible way for me to help grow my brand in conjunction with another great Canadian brand. This photo was taken uh, at Road Atlanta during the Petit Le Mans weekend in 2019 actually during Thursday uh, night practice. I captured this photo in Italy during the Rock Cup Superfinal at the world famous Lenato International Circuit. This photo was taken at Sebring International Raceway. I was down there for the classic 12 hours of Sebring and I saw the vehicles lining up for the pre-grid and we were looking at all the cars and I noticed this gentleman in a Porsche 904 putting on his gloves, getting his gear on. The story behind this photo is that as a creator, like you really go through times where you're not too confident in what's going on. You have good days and you have bad days. And I was having a bad day that day. I wasn't going very well and I couldn't, I didn't like any of my shots because I was trying to be artistic and shooting a lot of pans and nothing looked artistic. So I decided to try long exposure photography, which I'd actually only, well, I'd never done before. So I got the tripod out and tried to do some long exposures uh, at the final uh, bends there. And it ended up looking pretty cool. And uh, some of my, some work I'm really proud of. It, uh, it was the last day of the competition and I was actually sitting in the grandstands not intending to take the photo that I was, but noticed the low light and the, and the S's that the track made in the reflection and it caught my eye. I played around with the settings, you know, got a little more than I wanted to and, uh, and it became my favorite image from the event. Do you have a name or? I think I Instagrammed it as the S's because like that, it makes the S, right? Yeah. yeah. I'm going to name this photo uh, Night Trail because it's like light trails, you know, at night. Night trail, right? If you're involved in motorsport, you know that feeling when you have your helmet on, strapped, visor down, and everything kind of just fades away and you're just ready to do what you're gonna do. So, uh, Calm Before the Storm is the name of the shirt. Felt very fitting. Cool, I'll do one more.